Good evening and welcome to ATV News. My name is Shella Malosun. On tonight's bulletin, people with mental disabilities face neglect. Traffic accidents are on the increase. A good Samaritan opens a center for the kids and an eight-year-old takes Mudare by storm. People with mental illnesses are facing neglect as the government fails to accommodate them in national programs such as health and social services. Muchanata Chimuka reports. Vanu vanu rwara nefungwa vari kuramba vachisi wa muzvirongwa zvichinji zvakadai senyaya dze utano code 0 kana kuwaniswa kujika chaiko ATV pa yakatenera muguta re Harare yakasangana nevarwere vefungwa avo vaingo tetereka vachidzika zve mabini pasina munhu airatidza hanya navo kuburikidza nerusarura urwo vanu vanu rwara nefungwa vari kukundikana kuwaniswa rubatsiro muzvipatara nechimbi chimbi Right now, you find with our own society, it's a matter of mentality that we still have, that uh, sometimes we think if a person is physically challenged, it's, uh, it's something that is a person is cursed or something. So we tend to waste so much time going to some traditional healers, what, what, but as far as uh, something that at least a mentally challenged person can easily go to a hospital and then get some assistance. Ndiye kupenga kunaita vanhu isusa hatizokwani sekuti tisa msoro pamwe chete kana kuti family ise msoro pamwe chete ione kuti mwana kupenga kwaita kana kuti vanga vababa kana kuti vanga vani vaona kuti zvakonzereswa nei vanongosiya zvakadaro munhu otanga kuzika tsvina dzo mabini dzie dzia achifamba asina kupfeka achifamba akangorembedza zvinhu zvese panze mataya ari muhuro mabuka angobata pamaoko saka vanhu hati vaine shungu nevanhu vakata sevao Vamwe vanu taura onesha vanu ona seji konze roshi no ita kutivanu wa shike pa kura sika njere. Kwa pere kwa wa chita wati benza ri gireskwe, pati benzi rino fana honge ri chigireskwe wa mafuzawa wa rukamba nao. Sino konze rashi uwele chelo kune stetiri pedo nao, ne uti shi uwele shi nota pukira kwa tiri. Kwa vanu wa shinti wa ruku penga ne kuna kukuta, muma atinza wa, muruku batu watu nitu waka wanda wanda. Isi pesha rinyeze kufumaizi, wanu wa ruku bata bata, wa shikangaza murizavu. Zikwambo vamwano shandisa vana vavo kutanga upengesa mwana wake vamwe vomati ndandi vakaura yavo vamwe vanhu vasinga mbozi vivo mukurara mamu zvozo muka nasi nini mbereke pamwaka fakare nedzinzira rakaiti taizvo zvandiridi hari zivi kana namasoro vhero hapana zvakadai kune mamwe masangano ari kuedza nepanogona kubatsira vanhu vakadai we trying to accommodate people with disabilities also to access the services that we are providing. Um, and um, so I, I, I cannot give you the numbers now, but we have really a, a number of people in our network that are trained to specifically accommodate these needs. The number of accidents at traffic intersections is on the increase in Mutare as the council fails to repair broken traffic lights. Andrew Mambondiani gives us the story. Most fatal road accidents in the city of Mutare are being blamed on non-working traffic lights. The eastern border city has seven traffic light controlled intersections but only one set of traffic lights has been working for the past two years. Kwa kanzuru, alisu gazi sa marobo, si marozi, maakitendaru kwa itika mazwa yese, 4 or 5 a day. Kwa zwa mwa chai rasu, zi yoti wane right of way, ndi ya ni, ngo pinda. Marobo zi ka, mwamu teri mnumu amoto rina, wan robo ti yuwa zirusha anda. Ma ekstendi ya mwari kwa itika pane robo ti mamberipi mapurisa, hato mbu komboreri. And this is good attention. Yes, we should do so. It worries me. But you watch in your hands, you are cannot pass on your side. Motorists are blaming combi drivers for making the situation worse by failing to observe road rules. My combi, they don't stop crashing. My mama, mama robots. Do crashing? You are not going to go without my accident. Residents called on the responsible authority to repair the traffic lights and erect more lights in the city center. Ama robo se aifa na kutiwe zerwe hii. Nekuti zakaita mune mune zimwe nchimbo. 
Zirikunya sa kupangiza kuti apa panoda robot asikuti panoiswa give way kana stop sign ne traffic ya mamutare ya wandis failure by authorities to urgently repair the lights remains baffling and it seems for now it's poor service delivery much more than anything else reporting for ATV in Mutare Zimbabwe Touched by the plight of orphans and vulnerable children, a Mondoro man is now offering children educational classes under a tree. Robert Tafumane gives us the report. Tumaye <laughs> Out of interest, the Munar Majiri, as an HIV activist, Takati Susungat Tagevana, Marimunu, Varaman, Utachon of HIV. Within two months, the Tanga of February, we had 167 Mana, but Tanga Tawana Noraman, Utachon of HIV. We said, let's investigate more, put Chi, Chi Shampo die. Then we, that's when we saw that we were among what is good. There were school dropouts. Some had never gone to school. You get what I mean? I'm saying they never went to school. Vagarim Mondoro, Varukarabasa Guru, Rikubatwa, Narangwanim. And Ragato were never seen Barash, Tagaru Fadir. We are easy to dream a petitive girl says. They found but this is our one. Gone our Navashin, your garage, and ne <laughs> Kunyango zazo vana ava vachi zizira vari paspe muti. Ziri pachi na kuti ramango na ravo raka jeka. Kutaura kuno vana vari kwa nisawa zizo. Vave kushika zana ni makumi mashanu. Uye vana wani sikuwa wo zeku jika zinovaka muviri. Ndini muturwe na uwe ATV Robert Afmani ndiri kumondoro Zimbabwe. An eight-year-old boy has taken Mudare by storm by showcasing his stand-up comedy, dancing and singing talents. Andrew Mambondiani reports. Street theatre is not popular in the city of Mutare, but an eight-year-old boy has taken the city by storm through his artistic expressions. The boy is drawing large crowds during his street performances, which include dancing, singing and stand-up comedy. Isaac Gonora, who is in grade 2, said he learned his skills from his visually impaired father, Daniel. He has been wowing crowds in Harare where he performs alongside his father. An urban groove musician who watched Isaac perform at Mikos Park had a lot of praise for the young artist. He urged sponsors to assist the artist to develop his talent.
With such talent and proper guidance, the sky is the limit for young Isaac. Reporting for ATV in Mutare, Zimbabwe. Thank you for joining us. Good night.